What's your sneaker fan? Welcome back to our sneakers. Back at it like a motherfucking crack addict. Just kidding, guys. This is Tony D2 Wild's channel. And I know the background looks a little messed up right now. It's just because I have all the shoes in the car still. I have to go bring them out. And I want to get this video up before the day ends because it is kind of late. I did come home after sneaker games and I took a nap because I was tired. And that's probably why I look tired right now, too, because I literally just woke up. I'm not going to talk about the Jordan 1 raffle because this video is just a recap of Sneaker Games Miami. But if you want to go ahead and join, I am raffling off Jordan 1 Top 3. It is a size 7.5. You can go ahead and purchase that down in the description down below. I will leave a link to where you can purchase a ticket. There's a total of 300 entries, and right now there's about 223 taken. So make sure you get them while they last. And I'm sorry if my voice sounds raspy. Like I said, I woke up, and I don't know. I started feeling different. Anyway, Sneaker Game Miami was fun today. It was a lot more fun than last time. There was a lot of big YouTubers out there, and shout out for them for taking the time to come out to Sneaker Games. Honestly, today there was nothing else but good vibes, and it was lots of fun, there was a lot of heat too. There's a lot of the NNDOGs that released yesterday, there was a bunch of Yeezy V2s, there was a pair of Hyper Daps out there, shout out to the guy that had them, he was had a table right behind me, those are pretty sick. There was some never before seen Jordan 11s, there was crazy heat out there, I can't remember exactly, but if you do want to see the crazy heat that there was out there, go ahead and go to my vlog channel, you will find a link to that down in the description below, it just says my other channel. And it's not exactly a vlog channel, it's more like a, just a channel that I have to post anything else that I want that isn't related to sneakers. I also want to give a big thank you to Mike from a Sneaker Life, Boyd RC, Tony D2 Wild, and Blazonary Kicks for actually taking their time to not only talk to me, but talk to all the other fans and be humble about it as well. I also want to thank my fans that were out there, the ones that came up to the table and said what's up, took a picture of me, I put you in my vlog. It means a lot to me when you guys actually come up to me and say what's up because it does motivate me to keep going with this channel and try to grow it and make it better every single day. So basically this video is to talk about what I just talked about. Just saying thank you and shouting out people and giving you guys a little insight on what happened in SneakerCon. My bad, Sneaker Games. If you do want to see exactly what happened at SneakerCon, I will post up a few videos on my other channel of different things that happened there. By the way, I forgot to show you guys, but the R Sneaker shirts are in and these are the Christmas 2016 release. And honestly, these shirts are pretty damn sick. As you guys can see, it has the three shoes right here. Jordan 1, Ultra Boost, and then a V2. And then you have my logo on the front. It's going to be kind of hard to tell the quality, but the quality is butter. Anyways, I don't know if it'll be at Soul Fest on January 28th. Just because there isn't too much that's exciting that's going on. But I don't know, I might just go. I usually want to get a table so I can like sit down and talk to people and all that. Instead of just walking around and being lost in the crowd. So yeah, let me know in the comments below if you guys think I should go to Soul Fest or not. But I will for sure be at Sneaker Con Fort Lauderdale on February 11th. And I think I have a surprise for you guys. It's not a promise yet, but I think I do have a surprise for you guys. Oh, and one last thing I want to give is to everybody that did go through my table today and they subscribed to the channel on the spot or they did subscribe eventually. That does mean a lot to me. Again, like I said, it does get me motivated to keep going and pushing harder. Anyways, if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe. We are trying to get to 5,000 by SneakerCon for Lauderdale, which is February 11th. Make sure you stay woke. Our sneaker sign out. Peace.